That's a massive prawn. Good morning, John here. Today we're going to the Mekong Delta River. But first off, breakfast. Good morning, it's day four in Saigon and we are starving our day nice and early with some breakfast. So we're at a bakery called Wan Mi Hua Ma and they specialize in Wan Mi Hok La. Really crunchy fresh spaghetti and two sunny side up eggs. The op la, that means sunny side up. Looks like either tofu or some fish kind of fish cake. Thin slice of grilled spam and a different kind of luncheon meat and an egg. And you can't forget the pate and butter. The food came out really, really fast. We're sitting on these little, little seats on the side of the alleyway. All right, let's eat, get our day started. Oh, super crunchy. Let's get a bit of everything. Let's get a bit of egg. Spam. Get some of that butter. Do it yourself, but me. Delicious. Definitely recommend coming here for breakfast. I think they open up at 5 a.m. and it's really fast service. All right, let's go. Hey guys, we're actually booked a private tour to explore the Mekong River. So it's a two-day private tour and we're just on our way to our first stop of the tour which is a local market. Hey Ducky. So we just stopped at a marketplace in Gangduk and it's got a whole bunch of live poultry. We've got chickens and ducks all over the place. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just take a chicken home. Yeah, and then they Oh my god, is it still moving? Yeah, come go. What's that? Octopus? Two dollars. Two dollars one. It's like thirty-five thousand. That was an awesome local market. Ah, back in the car. Everyone was super intrigued. What our background was, where we came from. Right around the rice paddies. Let's go. Gonna have a quick toilet break before we go on our little journey by scooter. Ah, uh, Marley's mum was gonna kill her. Before we left, she was like, not allowed to go on scooters, not allowed to go on motorbikes. And what are we doing? We're going on a motorbike. Anyway, 
it's gonna be pretty cool. Um, we're gonna be going with one of the tour guides via scooter, so a scooter each, to a rice paddy field uh, close to the area where we are here. And she said we can fly our drone, so yay! We can get some drone footage finally. This is called the Monkey Bridge. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. <laughs> Heading into the yeah. rice paddy fields now. Oh wow. Whoa. Alright, we can do this. I'm scared I'm too fat. <laughs> You're gonna break it. Wait, what one person at a time? <laughs> <laughs> we might have too much weight. Otherwise I'm gonna break this. Oh. Yeah. Yay! Come on, you got this. Come on, you got this. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yay! High five. Yay. Alright, let's see if we can get some good drone footage. Hey guys! So we're standing in the middle of a massive rice paddy. It's so beautiful and green! I can just really appreciate the hard work that the Vietnamese people put here in terms of, you know, gathering the rice. We're told they wake up at 4am in the morning and they work all the way until sunset. Yeah, that's, that's hard work and dedication. Yeah. And apparently they only sell the rice for about 50 cents for a bag. Our first scooter ride, how was it? That was awesome. I don't know what our parents are complaining about. Yeah, sorry mom. That was pretty cool. <laughs> but was, I think um, it was yeah. good because the roads were uh, pretty quiet. I think they're mainly scared because of the city. Yeah. But out yeah. in the country, I don't think there's any issue. It's actually pretty relaxing driving through the countryside on the scooter. Pretty stable. Yeah, pretty stable, relaxing. Anyway, so we're back at our car and off to lunch, I think. Finally, lunch time. Alright guys, so we're at a beach called Dang Tang Beach. And we're going to have lunchy? Yes, we're having lunch uh, right by the beach at a restaurant called... Hương Bing. On this Mekong River tour, we were provided an awesome lunch by the team at Water Buffalo Tours. We had crunchy spring rolls, steamed lemongrass clams, barbecue jumbo prawns, caramelized pork stir-fried morning glory ganjua and fruit that we bought back at the markets what a fantastic lunch all right so this is how we are, we're gonna eat the clams speak like so Put in the nook, mum. And then you slurp it. Mm. What does it taste like? The sea. <laughs> the ocean. Fresh from the ocean. Fresh from the ocean. <laughs> Alright guys, thanks for watching the first part of our Mekong River tour. It was an amazing experience and we can't recommend it enough. If you aren't subscribed, please hit that subscribe button if you'd like to see more from us. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, leave a comment, share it with your friends and as always, thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next video.